Well, Derek has been insisting for a year that he wants to paint the bathroom, so we're going to paint the bathroom. Alright. It's going to be interesting taking this shit down. <laughs> we're going to do it right this time, though. Yeah. Because when we did the rest of the house, mm -hmm. we half-assed the taping, and then when we pulled the tape off, there's paint freaking everywhere. <laughs> Do a better job, right? That's right. We took uh, stuff out of the cab the vanity cabinet, so we're gonna have to t take down the. We're gonna have to take down that vanity. So we're just doing the prepping right now. So we bought this house two years ago, and uh, we just painted like the common areas: the living room, the kitchens, and the dining room, and we left off the bathrooms and uh, it's been driving me crazy. So we decided we're personalizing our bathrooms. Before we began painting, we took off all the vanity cabinets and uh, the light fixtures. Taping the edges of the tiles is very important. It avoids our paint splashes to touch the surfaces. Out. Now I'm going to have to put the tape over here, around all the way, and then uh, i got to prep the floors, and then i start painting. This was a team effort. Covering the toilet seats with the plastic is also very important. Just in case, just in case you never know. Just in case you trip and uh, knock over paint. The way we attacked this project was uh, Amanda was uh, painting all the big walls and I was using a, a small tip brush to paint all the edges from the ceiling going down and the corners of uh, the cabinet. Oh my god, this light fixture man, so 1991, I hated it. I took it off and I bought a new one. I'm gonna replace the, the vanity that took off from, from there. Um, I got a brand new one here. So, yeah, here we go. Things? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's try this again. I got another one from um, Home Depot. Okay, okay. No accidents this time. So, be gentle. Alright. Oh 
always something, man. Now it doesn't have connectors. I don't get it. Always something. I managed to install that. I, you always gotta make sure it's straight. So I'm gonna use a left like here to make sure it's like. There you go. Bam. So the next part is that I'm gonna connect the other one, connect all the wires, and then uh, test it out. Yeah. So connections are very easy, depending on what country you're from, but in the United States we use white and black to differentiate which side you're going to connect it, plus a ground. So you have black and white on there, and then this is the ground. So we can, this is uh, the ground right here. So we can do it two ways. So we can connect the ground here, and then attach this thing over there. It's going to be grounded. Or we can use the ground wire here and then connect it to the other one there. Um, it's still the same thing, but I'm just gonna connect the ground wire and then I go from there. Electrical work can be very dangerous, so if you don't know what you're doing, consult a professional. Painting was done at this point and it dried out, and uh, I installed a new vanity light, and then I started reinstalling the vanity cabinets. We took some beach themed pictures a while back and it's so exciting that we're hanging our work in the bathroom. This octopus is Amanda's favorite uh, art piece. He's loving the beach. I knew I bought that for a reason. Hey, looks good. Yeah? I wonder if anybody will notice. I wonder that too. <laughs> It didn't look like you would notice. I think it's a kind of good color. I think if you want with anything darker or anything, it'd be crazy. Yeah. That's good. Well, we painted because this used to be white and now blue. And we went with high gloss, apparently. And the guy was getting mad at us at home too because he didn't know what we were talking about. And we printed these, so we took these ourselves. So we printed these uh, a couple months ago. Anticipating we were gonna paint, but we didn't put them in the frames until now. We hung up all our stuff. We got our octopus, we got a sun, we got our paintings over here. We changed the curtain. These three different colors. This one's nice and fresh. And yeah, that's about it. Alright. Oh, and we changed the light. We had a really outdated that the light that Derek did, so we changed it. <laughs> I think I'm happy with what we did. So, looks good. Looks good so far. I hate this door. I'm gonna change it one of these days. Mm. I hate the doors in this house. Why? Those are fucking old and cheap. It's an old house. Yeah. I hate the patio furniture. You told me it's still functional. It's, it's day two of uh, painting. We painted the, the bathroom. They had the spare bathroom. Now we're painting our master bathroom. Um, once and for all, and then uh, next we'll be doing uh, we'll be doing a main bedroom and hang some curtains and all that stuff. So right now I'm just doing uh, preparations. Uh, I guess the people that we bought it from they had all these little things that were hanging on the walls and whatever. So it's like things that, that are hanging everywhere in the walls. Um, so I got we're not gonna hang anything on here. I'm gonna completely remove this, um, and then I gotta remove this. And the picture goes out. Look at that picture. That's from Costa Rica. Yeah. We gotta take that light out too. Yeah. We, ever since we moved in, we've had that light because we put this vanity in. And now we're gonna replace it with a normal light. Day two, we continued in our, in our master bathroom. And the previous owners had things hanging, out, hanging on the walls. Um, so the wall had like so many studs that we had to pull out. And then we received the hose using uh, caulking.
I was not a fan of this light fixture in our bathroom. So, did the same thing, bought a new one and changed it. For some crazy reason, day two seemed a lot easier. We prepped the room and then we began the painting. I was a lot more gentle unboxing this light thing so that I didn't want to break it. Again guys, electric work can be very dangerous, can set your house on fire, so if you don't know what you're doing, make sure you consider it professional. And also, if you're gonna attempt this, make sure that you switch off all your breakers. Teamworks breaks the dream works. This was easy. We finished and we started reinstalling back to vanity cabinet. Costa Rica a couple of years ago was like the best trip we ever took. And we went to this uh, one spot that had four waterfalls, but instead of walking up, you walk down to get to the mall, and then you had to walk back up to get to the end. This is, I think, the one second to the bottom that you know, we went to. That was the very last one, I think. We got into our undies because we were stupid and didn't bring any bathing suits. And no one was around, but it was like the best picture. It was the waterfalls, like. But we have uh, some cool videos of it, so we'll link that up here in the description so you guys can see that video. Don't forget. Day. We got this one at our favorite brewery, Pinellas Ale Works in St. Pete. This one's gonna be tricky. Look at the look. This shape in. Uh, maybe we move it over like there you go. Look, it matches me with the bridle. Yeah, I know. Did you know? That's why it's already that we've decorated everything that was that's in here the only different thing is the light I, I hated the light that was up there so we changed it and then um, yeah it's all done and then um next part will be the bedrooms um, yeah it's gonna be like a next few months project so we gotta finish the bedroom I gotta hang the uh, curtains there then uh, the last the very very last part will be my studio so yeah that was fun uh, doing the bathroom there's loads of fun <laughs> hmm there's loads of fun yeah um, I'm just happy that it's it's over and done with and um, yeah I'm doing a lot of icing on my body right now Mm -hmm. I've got a lot of problems. My back is killing me, my foot. It's a rough life. Yeah. 
all right guys so we'll see you on the next video um yeah we'll see you ciao